Hi there, Claire here and welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a gentle calming of your nervous system movement workout that I think you are absolutely going to love. Now this is a movement stretching little bit of activation that we are going to be doing that's going to help you get into your parasympathetic nervous system. So this is going to help de-stress you, it's going to calm you and just make you feel a little more zen in your life. Now in terms of equipment today, you don't need much at all. All you need is a comfy mat or a soft surface and of course yourselves. So let's start to feel zen, shall we? Let's get into it. Let's get it done. So let's find ourselves in a child pose. Knees are wide, toes are touching, and reach those arms long and down. And we're just going to take a few deep breaths here. A big inhale through the nose. Hold that for a second. And then big exhale through the mouth. Big inhale through the nose. Little hold and exhale through the mouth. One more inhale. And exhale. Nice, reaching those arms along. We're gonna ripple up and onto all fours. We're gonna go for a little cat cow here. So inhale, belly drops, gazing up to the sky. And exhale, press the floor away, reversing that curve. Inhale, belly drops. And exhale, press away. One more inhale. And exhale. And finding that neutral spine. Now we're just going to go for a little circle between our hands and our knees. And you can kind of let your body move with this however feels good for you. Remember to keep breathing. And let's reverse it. Rocking back and forwards. Feeling any of those niggly bits there. And settling onto all fours again. We're gonna send our hips backwards for a little ripple. Reaching those arms long, we ripple up through the spine. And then we tuck our toes, send our hips high to the sky, downward dog position. We then ripple forwards, as if we go to a plank, pop your knees down, send your hips back into a child pose. Again, so we ripple up. Inhale, tuck your toes, Exhale, press back. Inhale, come forwards. Pop your knees down. Exhale, back. Nice, big inhale. Come forwards, tuck the toes. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, forwards. Knees wide. Back, exhale, child pose. One more here, inhale, forwards. 
tuck your toes, exhale, and we hold this downward dog position. Nice breaths in and out here. With every exhale, you want to push your chest as if it's driving further to the mat, pressing the floor away. And let's step our right leg wide and opening that arm up to the sky. Close the door and step back to downward dog. We do the other side. So it's wide into a lizard. Open the same arm as leg. Keep your eyes on your hand. And back we go. Inhale. Exhale down. And back. Big inhale as we open and exhale as we step back. Nice and slow. Inhale, open. Exhale, back. Inhale, open. Oh, this feels good. And back. One more each side. And last one here, inhale, exhale, back we go. And we're gonna bring our right knee down to the mat and we're coming into this pigeon stretch. So we're just holding it in this position. Elbows can come to the mat. You can reach the arms long. And just lying here. All the deep breaths in and out. In through the nose and out through the mouth. Feel that stretch in the glute. And slowly press yourself up and rotate to the front, extending that leg long. We're gonna go for a nice little side bend here. My right arm's gonna reach up and over and my other arm goes down the left leg, reaching over to that left side. If you need, hand can be in front or behind to help wherever you're at. And coming up, we're gonna bend that straight leg behind our, towards our butt cheek. We're gonna just bring ourselves back here into a little stretch, wherever that is for you, maybe on your elbows. You can also lie flat if you need. Just enjoying a little bit of a stretch through the front of the quad there. Remember to keep breathing here, deep breaths in and out. And slowly pressing yourself up. We're gonna come so that this elbow comes down to the ground. So my right elbow comes to the ground and my left leg is the one that's moving. Extending that leg out ever so slightly, keeping your core slightly engaged in here. So nice little tone. We're just gonna lift the leg up and 
and down up and down so just a little bit of activation through our glutes here good go for four three two one good let's keep it lifted pulse it up for eight seven six five four three two one good extend that leg long we're gonna lift it up and tap it down good four more here for four, three, two, one. Now try to keep it lifted. We're gonna go for a little bend and stretch. I'm gonna reach my top arm over my head. Okay, go for four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna pulse it up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring it in and step it over the top. Little release of the glute there. So hugging your opposite arm around, sitting up nice and tall, hand comes behind you. Exhale, will allow you to twist a little bit deeper. Try to focus on keeping both of your booties squeezing to the mat. Both sides of your butt cheeks, I should say, squeezing to the mat. With your next exhale, come to the front. And we're gonna rotate the other way, pressing our other hand now on top of the knee and rotating the other way. So we're pressing that knee away from our body now. And coming back to the front. Now here, what we want to try and do is stack our knees on top of each other if we can. Whatever, wherever you're at is okay. Or if you like and you're super flexy, bring the, knee, the feet further forward, flex them, and press those knees down to the mat. Now holding this here, hands come beside you. We're thinking nice and tall thoughts here and we're just gonna tip our body slightly forward so I'm feeling more of a stretch in my booty and through my hips here. And coming back up from here, reach the arms wide. I'm going to cross my arms over each other. So my right arm comes over the top, my left arm swoops up underneath. I then swiggle the other arm around to grab and I create this little corkscrew movement. From here, we're gonna inhale, lift the arms upwards and exhale, floss it down. Inhale, lift, exhale down. Two more, inhale. Exhale, one more, inhale, exhale, and from here, give yourself a big hug. Holding this position here, I want you to tilt your head downwards and looking up to the sky, back down. And up, inhale down, and up, last one, inhale, 
and exhale. And lift those shoulders up and release the arms. Come to a comfortable seated position. We're gonna go for a little side bend here. Reaching our right arm over the top. We swoop it around and forwards, creating a circular motion, coming to the other side and open up. Reverse that, so we swoop over. Coming forwards, round and up. Inhale, exhale, and up. Inhale, exhale. Oh, nice. Okay. Let's bring our left leg in front now. And my right leg extends behind me. Coming into this pigeon stretch here. So you can be on your elbows or you can reach those arms long. Whatever you desire. And we are breathing nice and deeply. Reaching my right arm down my right leg and top arm goes, comes over the top. That left arm reaching long. Remember if you need a hand in front of you, you can or behind you, wherever you are at. There, coming up. Let's bend that leg behind us and we'll come back onto our hands, elbows, or you can lie flat. Big inhales and exhales. Enjoy this little stretch here. Feeling it through the front of the hip there. And with your next exhale, you're going to press yourself back so we're going to extend that leg a little bit longer. We're going to come on to our elbow here. My hand's going to come onto my hip. Let's do a little bit of glute activation here. So we just lift and lower. Inhale and exhale. Four. Good. We've got four more here for four. If your hand needs to come this way, that's okay. Three, wherever you're at. Two, one. Let's keep it lifted. Pulse it up. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna stretch that leg long. We're gonna go for our little lift and tap. Three, good. Four, keep that tone in the belly. Go for four, 
three, two, one. Now reach that arm over the head. Let's keep it lifted. We're gonna go for our little bend and stretch. Three, four, good, go for four, three, two, one. Can we keep it lifted, pulse it up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And bend it over the top here, hugging your opposite arm around. Give yourself a, a hug, a little stretch there. Sending your other arm behind you, sitting up nice and tall and rotating towards that side. Use your eyes. Exhales here. Oh my booty. Try to keep that glute pressing into the mat. And exhale, coming to the front. We're gonna press that knee away and lean back here. When I do this stretch, I kind of feel it through the front of my hip here. You might feel it a bit more in your glute. You might feel it in your inner thigh, just wherever is tight on you. It's different for everyone. But the main kind of focus is around this region here. And we're gonna face the front. Try to stack those knees so that they're in line with each other as best as you can. This glute for me, oof, it's a little bit tighter. So we are going to send our arms beside us now, sitting up nice and tall, and we're just going to tilt ever so slightly forward by keeping our nice flat back here. Arms are gonna come out. This time my right arm comes underneath and it hooks underneath and my left arm corkscrews that way. From there we inhale, lift them up. Exhale, lower them down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, down. Good, two more, inhale. Exhale. One more inhale. And exhale. Give yourself a hug. A little rotation here. Settle and tilt the head to the side and to the other side. One more each side. Inhale. And exhale. And let's come to a comfortable seated position. We're gonna go for our little tumble here. So left arm comes over the top now, inhale. Exhale, round we go, and up. Reverse that, inhale. Exhale, round we go. Up, inhale, exhale, one more inhale, exhale, round we go, and up. Let's extend our legs straight to the top of the mat and we're gonna go for a little stretch forwards here, down the legs. Relaxing here. Now 
and breathing into the back space, to the back body. And rolling up. So just a tiny bit of core activation here now with straight legs, reach those arms long, inhale here. Exhale, we come down. Halfway C curve. Inhale, we lift our arms up. Reach them beside us. Exhale, reach the arms forward as we go backwards. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, forward. Inhale, lift. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, four more, exhale, drawing that belly button in, inhale, three to go, exhale, inhale, Last two. Last one. And we're gonna roll all the way down and onto our backs here. Reaching everything long and away. Bring your arms beside you your feet onto the mat. Now from here we're gonna inhale inflate our belly. Exhale let it out. Bring your hands onto your belly. Big inhale. Feel it expand. And exhale let it all out. Hands come beside you. Inhale, we lift one leg to tabletop. And the other one joins. Exhale, we tap it down. And the other one goes down. Good, inhale, turn your belly. Other one joins. Exhale, down. down. So we want to try and keep our lower back pressing into the mat as we inhale and we move our legs. Exhale. Good. Inhale. Exhale. through the nose, remember, inhale, exhale, two more, inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, Hug those knees into your chest. Popping your feet back to the mat. We interlace our fingers behind our head. Just a few tiny crunches here. Inhale here. Exhale. We lift up. Gazing just above those knees. And then inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Good. Exhale, up. Inhale, lower. Think about your head being heavy in your hands and almost press your head back into your hands. Good. 
here we have four more, four, three, two, last one here. Give yourself a rest, hug those knees back into your chest. Final move here. Place your feet back onto the mat. We're gonna do a little bit of obliques. We're gonna reach our arms beside us and we're gonna lift ourselves just off the mat. We're gonna reach to tap our ankles for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come down. Hug those knees back into your chest. And bring your feet back to the mat. Send your knees wide for a little second here. So we're gonna do just a few deep breaths here. And this is a really great one that you can do when you're in bed or you just really wanna calm that nervous system down just through breathing. So hands on the belly. We're going to inhale for four counts, so we inhale. We hold for four, for four, three, two, one, and we exhale out for four, three, two, one, hold for four, three, two, one, big inhale, four, three, two, one, hold for four, three, two, one, exhale for four, three, two, one, hold for four, three, two, one, let's do a few more rounds. Just find a comfortable breathing state for yourself. You should be feeling a little bit calmer now. Some nice stretching, tiny bit of activation, nice and gentle. Be kind to yourself. And when you're ready, you're going to plant your feet onto the mat, rotate your knees and body to one side to slowly press yourself up and find a comfortable seated position. Let's go for a big breath to the top. Join the hands into heart center, exhale. And you are all done. Thank you so much for joining me this week for that gentle calming of your nervous system workout. Now, I hope you enjoyed that workout as much as I did. I'm feeling so zen now. <laughs> if you did, please don't forget to hit that like button, share it with a friend or family member who you think would like this workout. 
and please don't forget to hit that subscribe button as it does support my channel and I do post new videos and workouts every week. Thank you so much for coming and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.